let's talk about the overwork principle. I know in this day of efficiency and extra hacking and I'm going to give you the ultimate hack that will provide you dividends, will provide you money, and it will make your life better. I promise. I seriously promise. Last August, I started doing a lot of live streaming, a ton of live streaming, and it was very profitable. It was. But one of the things that I had to do was to condition myself for the next step. Doing live streams is easier than it is to do these kind of videos. One of the things you have to do when you're about to hit the overwork principle is you got to get rid of the clock. You got to ignore it. You got to just smash it. You got to kick it up to the curb because clock watching and the overwork principle does not get it. It's much easier. You sit, you talk, you engage the audience, you do all that stuff. But doing this it takes planning, it takes staging, it takes knowing where you're going, it takes knowing what kind of story you want to tell, right? So it's not as easy. Last August, I developed my video self by doing one stream a day, and then December, I crock it up to where I was doing two streams a day. Now, what all of this did was create a perspective. When you create a perspective, you open up the doors to greatness. My job here isn't to teach you how to be ordinary. My job here isn't to teach you how to make a little extra money. My job is to teach you guys how to be great, how to set something up that will give you the life that you want. So some of these tools, some of these things, these are just not for the average person. You know, if you're the average person, put that in the comments and put, why are you average? And more importantly, put, why do you want to stay average? So I built myself up where I was doing about hour prep work in an hour to an hour and a half long live stream. So that's four and a half to five hours doing these live streams, right? Well, now that looks like I've acclimated myself to it. So it's not really a big deal. But now that those four and a half to five hours of planning and doing are ingrained in me and I've acclimated to it, now I can put in an hour and a half to two hours to make these kind of videos. What I did there was called progressive overload, where you overload your mind because it's a bodybuilding principle where you lift weights and you raise the weights and you lift that weight. That's progressive overload. But it doesn't just work for your body. It works for your mind. Most of us are weak of mind. We're weak of uh, ambition. We don't have the perspective that we need to be successful. We don't have the perspective to become great because we don't even know what really good is. I want you to think about that. We don't really know what really good is. We know what average is. We know what getting by is. We know what making do, doing just enough. We know that all day long, but we don't know what it takes to be great because to be great, you have to overload yourself. You have to overload your body. You have to overload your mind. You have to put yourself in the position that you're going to win. You have to put yourself in the position where you to taste a little bit of greatness. I put myself through this and it was hard and I was struggling. Uh, there was a lot of things that were going on. But now that I've acclimated myself to this, I can put out even more videos because what I did is I went toward the higher plane of creating videos by dedicating four and a half to five hours a day, five days a week, sometimes seven. It's become 
so easy to make these 12 to 15 to 20 minute videos because I've changed my perspective. I've gotten past being normal. I've gotten to the point where I'm not tasting greatness yet, but I've moved beyond average and I'm kind of going toward exceptional. And that's what you have to do if you want to make exceptional money need to have exceptional output. You need to have a certain level of greatness, a certain level. This puts you in a position where you can be better and more well built. Because just like you build your body, you have to build your mind. And there's a lot of things that you need to do. One of the things that happens when you're trying to build greatness, when you're trying to prep yourself to the next level, is the mind taps out much quicker than it can. The body taps out much quicker than it can. And it creates this space where you know you can be better, but it's just so hard to push. And that is all up in the mind because now I feel like a video beast. I feel like, you know, I can do this. I can do so many videos. I can be creative. But I put in the work. And let's look at the work. August, September, October, November, December, January. And that's just the six months of putting in the work, getting good results. I was making money, but I feel that I can make so much more money by building myself and working on becoming great and taking these videos to another level than just doing what I was doing. And that's what you're gonna see. Now, that's just a little tip for you to enhance yourself by enhancing your activity. You have to overwork. Now you don't have to overwork for years and years, but there must be periods in your life where you are busting, you are putting out, you're putting out content, you're putting out blog posts, you're doing Facebook. I mean, you're like going bananas. You gotta do that to take off, to get to that point where you have achieved lift. And then it gets a little easier, but not much. But the thing is, the reason it feels that it gets easier is because your perspective is better. Your perspective is deeper. Your perspective is so enhanced that you're doing twice the work, three times the work, four times the work, but it doesn't feel like it because you've built yourself. All right, so I got a special for you dudes and dudettes. The Superior Mindset Bundle check it out it will enhance and talk about these principles that I talked about in this video Business school is in session. Learn how to make money, increase your wealth. One of the biggest problems I have is that people come to the YouTube channel, they'll see me and they want to get something, but they don't know where to start. So I have solved that problem today. If you're brand new, welcome. We're glad to have you. Look forward to serving you a long, long time. If you want to get this knowledge, if you want to start a business, 
I have created a blueprint, a roadway for you to actually start making changes in your life. Because this is one of the things that I have learned. When I was doing 30 days to 2,500, I learned that there were some people who did better than others. And I was like, why are these people doing better than other people? What's going on with these people? And what I have discovered, and let's see. Let me go ahead and get that. What I've discovered is that people who came in with a business already, they did really well with 30 days to 2,500. Remarkably well. It was like mind blowing for some of them. Then there were people who didn't do well. And these were people who did not have a strong mindset or were not in business. So what I've des designed is for you to go through this pathway because essentially when I get someone who's brand new to the channel and they've never had a business, there is so much work that has to be done. I mean, I know there's folks on the internet that makes owning the business, running the business look super easy and it's not. And it's one of the most complicated things that you'll do in your life. But once again, people want the path of least resistance. That is not what we're going to have. So we're going to go here and we're going to go under all right, so this is where you start. This is the uh, blueprint. First thing you're going to do is get the Hustler's Mindset, Pimp Your Mind for Success. That's your free audio book. That's where you're going to start getting that mind correct. Then you're going to move to this. Money Management the Basics of Finance and Wealth Development. Before you get new money, you must optimize the money you already have. If you, as it was said in the part of the live stream this morning, if you don't manage a little bit of money well, you're not going to manage a lot of money well. It's the same person. The only thing that changes is the money. Look at the number of athletes who go broke because they've never learned how to manage money. They never learned how to compartmentalize, how to do the five checking account blueprint. They've not done that. So this is the, the first course you need. And I keep telling everybody that. I've had a lot of people who take this course and they booked a console because they wanted to know more. So this is the course that you need. Then after that, we're going to go to the third course, Becoming the Boss. You have to make this mental shift about being into a producer mode. So this is the third course you will take. And one of the things that I've done is I've priced this stuff so well that, you know, there, there is a few of you who are kind of sitting back, who are emailing me like, hey, I want to buy these courses. What's the best price you can give me? That never works. Those deals never materialize because they were required for me to sit on email and go back and forth with people all day. And it just typically doesn't work out. Uh, the courses are so economical. All right, this is what you're going to get after becoming the boss. This will be your fourth course, uh, the Power of Six Productivity course. This course will help you get stuff done. This is a habit that you need to develop, how to manage your time, how to get stuff done. When you start a business, there's going to be so many things to do that this course will help you learn how to get stuff done how to, what's a priority, what's not priority. This course will do it for you. All right. So the fifth course you will get, Scripted Days. This is a life-changing course. I think it's too cheap, but I want you guys to benefit. It will give you the power of written manifestation. 
it will straighten out your uh, bad habits. It will put you on the path of productive success. It will teach you how to, you know, set up a morning ritual, set up an evening ritual. A lot of things. This will be the fifth course. Now, these five courses in the free audio book will build a foundation. When I was doing 30 Days to 2500, I had some students do amazingly well, and some students struggled. The people who did well already had A, a business, or B, a superior mindset. The foundational courses will give you the superior mindset. Let's say you're a person who wants to start a business but have no clue to where to start. This next section is for you. Typically, business success comes from practicing business skills. One of the best ways to do that is by reselling. You got to get your feet wet. This is where you will start with the reselling courses. Uh, this is a collection that gives you the storage auction book, the pimping Craigslist stuff, all of this stuff to get you geared for resell. How to have a great garage sale, all that. Now, once you've gotten the first five courses, your next move will be 30 days to 2,500. This course is for people who need to learn how to sell and how to sell and set up business. It will be thought provoking. This is also a good course for people with established businesses. Remember how I told you the people who had already businesses did extremely well. So go ahead. You know, if you have a business owner, if you go through because 30 days to 2,500 is a long course it's going to take you about two months to go through it but it'll be well worth it because in these two months you're going to learn stuff it's going to open up your eyes it's going to create new shifts in how you think and how you do business all right uh the seventh course will be asking for the money how to be an uber salesperson now, don't get this course unless you have something to sell. Just reading a book or reading a book about sales without having something to sell is a waste of time. You need to actually read about it and put this stuff into practice. And once again, uh, for all you folks who keep asking me about the Luponics book, I don't know the name. Can't remember the name of it. All I know is it had a red and black cover. Can't help you. People keep like, man, it sounds dope. What's the name? I don't know the name, man. I don't know the name. Just had to put that out there. All right. And for the business owners, this will be defined as people making money and paying their bills with the proceeds from the business. You know, if you got like a side business or something, and this might be for you, but this is for the business owners. You should get the art of holding on how to set up your legal structure. If you're a business owner making money, you are a target and you will need to protect yourself. Now, for the people who want to save some money, I have a curated bundle with all the courses except the art of holding to get you started and get your business aspirations. So this is the bundle that includes most of the courses. There you go. So if you are new to the channel and you're like, hey, where do I start? That's the pathway. That's the pathway to get started because from a foundational standpoint, you need to establish the foundation before you get off into trying to start your business. Because like I said, you know, I, I got a ton of feedback from 30 days to 2,500. And if I had been thinking, I would have did this like way sooner, but essentially taking those lessons derived from that course, you got people who are not mentally prepared to start a business. It's, it doesn't mean that they can't become mentally prepared. It's just a process. It's going to take them a little time to, you know, like you got kids. All kids don't learn at the same rate. You got some kids who learn slower, and but they can still get there. And essentially, this is what you will be going through with the foundational courses. They will help you get your mind right. This will help you get your mind right. The DSL Chronicles, hell yeah, they ain't going to buy people. I mean, seriously, I, I, I pretty much ignore those folks because I've been down that path before. Typically, the people who are like, I want this course, I want this course, I want this course. 
and who want to talk to me uh the number one reason that people want to talk to me is to get permission to do what they think they want to do this like well if glendon thinks this is cool no you you need to give yourself permission you need to validate yourself you need to um believe in yourself mike ellie this ain't no theory this ain't no theory man these courses have come from my business experience there is no theory here let's see anthony johnson me and my cousin got busy today we had a hard time starting our generator wouldn't start for our mobile watch but we strung it together made a hundred bucks for a few hours see once you go through this transformation once you get that first good sale that first blow the money it becomes addictive it becomes very addictive now what i'm going to do for the you know starting next week there's going to be a lot of new training so i'm going to do a video probably sunday or monday talking about the new training and how you can get a hold of that now if you have never started a business this stuff is good for you especially 30 days to 2500 and the money management course i've heard, got a lot of feedback from that people like it it has helped them manage their finances because here's the thing if you go ahead and start making a lot of money with your bad money management habits right now it's the money's just you're not going to get the best use of the money you you need to learn how to hold on the money and this is what the course teaches you so you know next week we will get into um the the new stuff but the new stuff will build on this it won't be the same information it'll be new information and more of it for business owners i don't really have a lot of courses for business owners other than the art of holding maybe 30 days to 2500 and asking for the sale those only courses for business owners uh, a lot of this stuff is side hustle stuff uh beginning business person so once again just go ahead you know if you're brand new to the channel you just found this welcome thank you appreciate you um this is what we're going to do. Michael Gardner. So it's true. This guy I'm working for in real estate made like 15 K and spent it all. People that thirst, you know, that, that, that thirst is a big, big problem. That build up thirst of you wanting stuff. You want to live a certain lifestyle. Once again, the money management course will help you with that. Let's see where we are. Cool. Because what I'm, this is going to be a very short live stream because I'm going to take it down and I'm going to put it at the end of all the newer videos. So people who are coming into the fold, you know, the new folks, because I got a lot of new folks. I get, you know, emails and stuff like, hey, Glennon. Man, I'm really excited. I like what you're saying, but where do I start? This is where you start. Okay. So all of the information is below. You can start with your first five foundational courses, then start going wild on the other stuff. And very soon I will have some new information that will build on these principles that will take you to the next level. So with that, I will see you guys later.